Hey friends, it's Akideris. So I feel like it's a rite of passage that when you come to visit or live in Japan, that it's one of those things that you just have to do. And that is staying at a capsule hotel. And I found one, so I was looking online and you could reserve either an overnight reservation or a nap time reservation. I got the nap time reservation just for the sake of the video. I think the overnight stay is about 3,000 yen. The nap time reservation, which I got it for about two hours, is 1,000 yen. Pretty good deal. So I'm gonna give you guys a tour of my first experience. All right, let's go. Okay, so I just checked into the hotel. Um, all of the women stay on the second floor. I'm gonna take you guys to Nikai and give you guys a tour. So I'm in the locker room right now and I just grabbed my stuff that was already in there. So it was a bag that had slippers, which I need to put on before I get into the capsule room. And then it had a toothbrush and a pajama set and some towels if I wanna to take a shower here. The shower room is just around the corner and if you want to wake yourself up and you didn't bring any of your skincare, the hotel has some milky lotion, face lotion, and face wash. I think I've seen people that even live in manga hotels, the amount that you pay per night sometimes equates to being cheaper than a regular apartment. It's kind of eerie in here. Okay, so this is the women's only floor and this is for capsules 211 to 262 on room 213. Okay, get open. Okay, did it work? Looks like someone is sleeping over there. So I'm gonna be like really, really quiet and just do a voiceover. Okay, so I finally found my capsule hotel and when I was trying to settle in, I couldn't figure out how to turn on the light for the longest time. And lo and behold, the light is the button right next to the number. So when I figured that out, I tried to talk into the camera, but it was just not working out. Like this is how quiet I am. Jokes, I think that I can talk, but like really, really softly. But this is my capsule hotel and it's very, very small, but it's just big enough for me to comfortably stretch out my legs and not have a problem. Yeah, so that's not happening. But I was getting settled into my capsule hotel and I couldn't figure out how to close the curtain for the longest time. And I felt really bad because I had to ask the kind woman that was resting next to me on how to do adult things. Thank you, kind woman. Please assist me. Oh, you are a godsend. Thank you. My capsule hotel came with a TV set as well as a pair of headphones that was honestly pretty worn out. But you know what? I rented it for just a nap, which I'm gonna do later in this video because, you know, I can't just not use it for the intended purpose. And then it also came with settings where you guys can turn off and on the light as well as adjust the dimness of it. And then it also comes with a button for the fan and of course an alarm clock. So unless you want to be charged an extra 500 yen per 30 minutes to an hour, then I would suggest that you utilize the alarm to the best of your ability. Just for perspective, this is me in the corner of my capsule hotel. So it's actually really, really spacious, even though it's a small room in itself. So the thing is, is that capsule hotels, they are smaller than your normal hotel and probably your normal room, but for something that's quick, for something that is good for just sleeping for a night, it's really not that bad. In fact, I would argue that this is actually more comfortable than some homes out there, to be honest. And I'm four foot 11 and me sitting in the corner kind of gives you a better look on how spacious that a capsule hotel really is. And when I stretch out my legs, there's still a lot of room for someone taller than me. So this is like the first time I've had to pay to take a nap. And I figure that this is really good if you're just like traveling or maybe you came out all the way for like a business trip and you came like a little early, maybe like an hour or two and you want to rest for a bit. I think that this would be a really good opportunity to use a capsule hotel. Actually, 
just woke up from a very deep and short nap because it is 5.42 right now. I still have this capsule hotel until 6. I rate capsule hotels 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Why didn't I book this longer? I don't know. But thank you for watching this unintended ASMR video. Appreciate you guys for watching. Subscribe to my channel for more content. And I will see you guys in the next video. <coughs>